the first part of the presentation essentially showed you what RMP is all about, its features, its benefits, and the pricing. Uh, this part of the presentation will actually walk you through the actual demo and show you the courses, what kind of screens you can expect, and uh, and how to navigate through the courses and uh, other details. So we'll actually go through the, the demo. This is the screen that you see when you want to log in, and uh, once you click your user ID password and log in, uh, you would see the full listing of courses and uh, as you can see here we have packaged for you uh, the following courses antimony laundering, bank branch management, Basel to corporate governance, counterparty credit risk and so on. Now for the next uh, few minutes I'll just uh, expand all these listings so you can see the actual courses within these libraries. As you can see, this is definitely a very detailed listing and I'm sure if you're going to go through all these courses uh, with a sincere effort and attempt to answer all the questions, attempt to grasp all the concepts, uh, you would significantly have an extended uh, learning in risk management and uh, this is you know, our, our understanding and I'm sure uh, RISCO can provide that edge to you when it comes to risk management if you're able to attempt and, uh, and learn all these concepts. This is really a lot of learning. Uh, that can provide you a, a significant uh, edge within your career as well as on your day-to-day -day working. Often you would see people who are uh, who are exposed to uh, market risk management, credit risk management or in general any risk management jargons and they're actually amazed and uh, just looking around to see what it really means. Well after, after doing these courses I'm sure that you'll be able to understand most of the jargons and most of the concepts thrown out in the day-to-day the -day meetings when we are doing our tasks whether you are in the IT field, whether you are in finance, internal audit, uh, or any other uh, particular domain area or job responsibility, you would always come across uh, risk management concepts and uh, issues. Uh, and, 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 and having an understanding through these courses will, will give you uh, an additional edge uh, to have those understandings. So as you can see, very elaborate uh, libraries, very elaborate courses. Uh, we'll just take a uh, walk you through some of these uh, courses. Let's take what is money laundering to start with. As you can see on the screen, you have various options uh, to interact and uh, to ensure that your learning experience is good. You have in chat, chat option, you have messaging options that you can message your concerns and your issues for support. Uh, you have discussion option whereby you can discuss uh, certain issues, concepts with other people uh, who, are, who are doing these courses along with you. You can see the progress and uh, this progress comes at, at, at uh, aggregate course level as well as at a library level. It gives you the status, which ones you have started, not started, completed and which ones you have passed. Uh, it gives you an option to use notepad to add your notes which is again at the course level and all this information at the end of the, the certification uh, can be can be downloaded so that you can use all these notes that you've created and uh, specifically uh, noted uh, with your learnings. You can use feedback options, you can use calendars to schedule certain events and uh, so we'll just walk through the course and see how it looks like and what kind of interaction you can expect.
as you can see the courses have uh, visuals audio uh, certain level of uh, java video interaction interactive graphics as well as exercises that you need to attempt uh, in, in order to uh, confirm that you have understood the concepts uh, we also have a, a glossary section whereby you can see all all the terms that are used within the course and then it gives a full understanding of uh, what are the specific abbreviations used and uh, specific definitions used uh, this is throughout the courses this information uh, certain courses at certain screens would also give you a uh, job aids exercises and certain uh, formulas that you could use and it basically these are additional information that helps for uh, learning that helps a user to actually apply the learnings in, in a practical day to day uh, jobs it will give you information about templates it might give you information in excel sheet or PDFs which are linked to outside world. So we continue the course. Finally, we look at the index and uh, here you can see uh, all the specific uh, topics within this course. So currently we are in the anti-money laundering library. We are in the course one which is called introduction to anti-money laundering. And these are the specific slides or you can say the pages within that uh, one hour program. And uh, it gives you access to jump, uh, move around within the course. Uh, and we also have a quiz at the end of the section and uh, essentially this is used to confirm that you have understood the concepts and uh, and the very uh, mainly a conceptual level uh, multiple choice ranging between 10 to 15 questions and uh, if you just randomly just you know, select some answers and uh, let's see if you can get a score so you can see here uh, which ones are right which is the wrong a full explanation of the correct and the wrong ones and uh, and we believe that this is a very important uh, aspect of the overall learning and uh, th this gives an example of how you can validate your learning at each course level. We'll exit from this course and uh, you know let's take another one just for uh, for understanding let's go to uh, branch branch security management for example. course duration is uh, approximate here it's, it depends on user to user and how much is able to grasp and what is the speed of learning Similarly, let's take a little complex uh, example. Here, as you can see, it's a duration of two hours and about 54 uh, pages. You also have little uh, side information that uh, tells you more or gives you more information. You just click on that and uh, you'll get some more information about the specific topic and the concept under discussion.
Then click on buttons for more information. Various examples are used throughout the courses to, to explain the concepts and uh, this again is a very good way to learn uh, simply and in a very simple manner uh, complex uh, situations. Lots of examples and exercises throughout the program. So essentially this is uh, what the, the actual demo of the program is. You can view which courses you have started, which courses you have completed and so on. Uh, the, the expiry of the product is one year from the date of purchase, the date of activation of the login ID. And uh, so essentially this is uh, the, the overall learning when it comes to e-learning courses. Uh, the actual interactive uh, session, which is 40 hours of learning, uh, is uh, separately scheduled uh, by RISPRO uh, based upon the, the candidate's availability uh, preferences and the topics are communicated by email about a week in advance for uh, registration. Uh, and then the two uh, totally uh, would give you the full training when it comes to uh, risk management learning. Thank you very much uh, for your time and hopefully, you know, if you have any information, you can get in touch at uh, manoj.jan at risk pro dot n thank you